Hi. Hello, everyone. I'm Vanessa. And I'm Erica. And welcome back to another episode of An Italian in My Kitchen. Today, we are making a very interesting cake. This cake uh, combines together chocolate chips and ricotta. Just like cannoli. And it's called? Italian chocolate chip ricotta cake. So we are going to show you how to make it. And this recipe is super easy and quick. So you'll enjoy it very much. Preheat oven to 350 degrees. And also grease and flour a nine inch cake pan or a bun pan, or you can even just use the cooking spray to spray it. In a large bowl, beat together the eggs and the yolk and the sugar until the nice, uh, creamy and light, about three to five minutes. Then add the vanilla and the ricotta and beat to combine. In a medium bowl, whisk together the flour, baking powder and a pinch of sugar. Then add to the cream mixture and mix just until combined. So now that we have our mixture, we are going to add as a last step our chocolate chips. But first, mix into the chocolate chips a teaspoon of flour so that they won't sink to the bottom of the pan while they're while the cake is baking in the oven and then fold them into the mixture now spoon the mixture into the prepared pan and then bake it into the oven for about 30 to 40 minutes. You can check with a toothpick to see if the cake is well done. The cake is out of the oven, we're gonna let it cool down and then we're gonna sprinkle on top some ice and sugar. And then we're gonna eat it. Here we have our cake. It's all pretty and decorated. And we're going to taste test it for you. <laughs> Go ahead. Nice and soft. Full of mm -hmm. rich deliciousness. So good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Buon amore. It's really good. Um, the ricotta really gives it that nice uh, richness and the chocolate chips are chocolate chips so you can't go wrong with that. <laughs> <laughs> and how do you store it? You can keep it up to two days in an airtight container or just wrap it really well at room temperature. Or you can also freeze it and it will last in the freezer for about three months. But it's not gonna last that long. <laughs> So we hope you enjoyed this recipe. Remember to subscribe to our channel if you like the video and the other recipes and we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.